welcome back to vlogmas it is day seven it is the 7th of december and i am back with more of whatever we're calling this yesterday i made a mistake on the treehouse i put number nine on where number six should go this has caused some confusion today when i started trying to find the next piece but we'll sort that out when we get there let's start with something cheerful it's all supposed to be cheerful <laughs> oh dear i've just realized that if the treehouse isn't cheerful then i'm not doing vlogmas correctly am i <laughs> let's start with something less stressful this is the advent for change i keep saying advent for change it's advent of change i'll try and correct myself if i get that wrong again the advent of change charity calendar in which every door contains a charity that you have helped by the purchase of the calendar and we are looking for day seven day seven there is Willow, special days for seriously ill young adults. Today, you have helped a seriously ill young parent spend precious time with their children by contributing towards a special day together making memories. That's fabulous. That's not a charity I've heard of before. If you've heard of Willow, um, I, like I said, that's, that's a new one on me. Special days for seriously ill young adults. So for parents who know that if their time with their families is short and precious, what a fabulous charity that one is. Okay, there is no stress in a Reese's peanut butter cup. The only stress in this one is finding my door. There it is, number seven. And we've had a much higher preponderance, there's a word, of the traditional peanut butter cups than of the other variety as yet. Should I tear my... Now, do you tear your doors off? Are you a reckless advent calendarite? Do you rip all your doors off so you can see where you've been? I think it would be easier if I did that. It would stop me trying to peer at doors that have already been opened. So I am. I'm I'm shredding my calendar. So I've had number five. Is that it? How many have I got in my hand? I've got one, two, three, four, five. I've only got five doors and we've done seven days. There's two. There must be another open door there somewhere. Love is an open door. Oh, four up there. There we go. So now I know which ones I've opened, at least. Advent calendars are never supposed to be this difficult. Skinny calendar. Let's take me doors off as well. You were only supposed to blow the bloody doors off. I can't blow the bloody doors off for this one. It's fighting back. Day number seven at the top there. Is... Oh, it's purple. It tastes Skinny Dream Chocolate Toffee Bar. Um, a couple of days ago, one of my presents from Sharon was a box of toffee bars. <laughs> Plenty of those now, yummy. Um, have I taken off all the appropriate doors? I think I have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I have. Okay. One thing to mention. I don't know if you guys can even see the Christmas lights now. I have changed the Christmas lights. Because I had a viewer who said that she wasn't able to watch Vlogmas because of the flickering lights. So I've changed them to just solid lights and I don't know if they're even showing now. I guess I'll know in the editing process. But yeah, I turned the flickering off and now I don't think you can see them at all. <laughs> oh well. Okay. Tree of Doom. Advent tree. So yesterday I accidentally put on to the sixth slot, which is here the number nine piece which was this bauble taking it off the number six should have been this piece of bunting and i am much as confused as it gets it goes from there to there this is going to be another blue tack <laughs> this is definitely going to be another piece that needs blue tacking because it just hangs i am sure that if you were just making this tree at home and you weren't going to wander around with it and move it around your office and move it out of the way of filming and move it back the next day I'm sure that those pieces would stay on perfectly well without blue tack it's only because I am faffing with it all the time that they keep falling off so I'll blue tack that one in place as well later in the meantime let's find number seven and see if we can get today right number seven is a teeny owl hang on It's a little owl, and I'm guessing it goes near the top. Yep. Yeah. I'm referring back to my picture for guidance. There's the seven slot. So I'll pop the owl on the roof. 
there he is. And furthermore, do you remember when I said, oh, it appears like day one is just building the house? It wasn't. Day one was the piece that I had dropped on the floor. <laughs> I found it about three or four days later. So day one was a little tree down the bottom there. There we go. It is coming together. A lot of you have said in the comments how much you like it. It's linked below. I got it from Amazon. I think I said in the beginning I got it from Etsy. That was a lie. Got it from Amazon. It is linked below in the comments. Um, I'm sure you could order one and catch up for this year. I, I do like it, but as I say, I'm sure it's better if you're just going to leave it somewhere and not keep, keep carrying it around. Okay, Sharon's box. I have had a rummage and put things near the top. Day seven. It's a squishy one. Face masks. Oh, hang on, is it just face? Let's have a look. I've got vitamin vita, vita masks i can't read vita masks pearl sheet mask well i look like a pearl of an oyster by the time i finish with that one do we think and a watermelon sheet mask which is brightening i could do with some brightening in this weather i find that this weather my skin goes very dull and this is a skimono total conditioning oh this is a foot mask that one's a foot mask i could definitely do with some uh, some feet improvement fantastic Lovely. Thank you so much, Sharon. I really appreciate them. I really appreciate them. I really appreciate those. Um, anyone who watches regularly will know I love a face mask. So thank you, Sharon. Absolutely fantastic gift, as always. Now, where have I put my big notebook? I have it. Okay. Your movie quote for today. Remember, you need to know which movie the quote is from. Write it down. Write in the notes. So today is day seven. Your day seven movie quote. It's a long one. Christmas is just about my favourite time. Ever since I was a little kid, I always felt like it was my own personal holiday. Christmas is just about my favourite time. Ever since I was a little kid, I always felt like it was my own personal holiday. If you know what movie that is from, write the answer down with a number next to it, and I will be back tomorrow with just day eight. It'll be day eight. Take care. Bye for now. <laughs>